Good morning, Union High School. I'm Brittany Brody. And I'm Nally Morales. It's Wednesday, February 27th. Welcome to this edition of the Almost Daily News. Today is the last day to sign up for the Red Cross Club Annual Blood Drive. Union students give the gift of life by donating their own blood. If you are 17 years or older, all you need to do is sign up in your English class. But if you are 16 years or younger, you will need a permission form. You can pick up these forms in the nurse's office. Tomorrow you'll be called out of class to, do to donate. One person giving blood can help three people out with their gift. Tomorrow will be a great day. Seniors, this is your last reminder that Friday is your deadline to get your picture taken for the yearbook. Call Montag today to set up an appointment, 249-9044. The yearbook photo is free and there's no obligation to buy anything. They'll give you many options, but you do not have to buy anything to be in the yearbook. Don't miss out on being in your senior yearbook. The Union High School SAFE team does a lot around the school to make our place a safer place to learn. Student leaders are always ready to listen to any problems their peers might have. Here's a little video brought to you by our Union SAFE team. Did you know that 90% of those that die by suicide have clinical depression? 20% of teens will experience depression before they reach adulthood. 20% have tried alcohol. One in three high school students have been involved in an abusive relationship. Nearly one million teenage girls become pregnant each year. 12% of high school students have gone without eating for 24 hours in an attempt to lose weight. 14% of students have seriously considered suicide. 12% had a concrete plan. Three-fourths of shooters of the 37 largest shootings have told someone about their plan. 50% told more than one person. What if the people they had told had gone for help? What if there was a program that helps students in situations like this? How many lives would be saved? How much safer would our schools be? Safe Team supports and helps us through problems we face as high school students. Problems like alcohol and drug abuse. Peer conflicts. Dating violence. Teen pregnancy. Eating disorders. Depression. Self-mutilation. Other physical and mental disorders. But how does it work? Prevention is key. Prevention isn't always enough. So we learn the warning signs and... We know when someone needs help. We provide this help through peer counseling. School awareness campaigns. Life skills training. Or just being a friend. We also set up forms about problems we feel are prevalent in our school. We also make decisions and our coordinators help. Our coordinators care for each of us. They work with us as equals. And making a huge difference in our lives. These stresses and strains of being a teenager in our society today are difficult for adults to understand. Safe Team allows us to assist each other through the use of the adults in our building. We tell the adults what needs to happen, and they listen. Being part of the safe team gives me the satisfaction of helping people around us. Creating a safer environment for our fellow students and communities. Not only does our safe team coordinator act as an advocate for us, we act as advocates to one another. Safer school is created. Once we have a safer school, we have a safer community where students can learn and succeed. Stand up loud, go against the crowd. Hello students and faculty of Union High School. The video you have just seen provides students with a support system at school. Safe Team members and faculty that support Safe Team will be identified today with name tags that show the Safe Team logo. Anywhere you see the Safe Team logo, you will find a person willing to help. Our Safe Team at Union has done some great things this school year, raising awareness on many topics students face. If you or someone that you know needs help, please take a stand. Your efforts in helping someone else or yourself will remain confidential. Ms. Schaefer in room 1130 is always available to care for our students. Please reach out to her or any of our counselors for help. Thanks, Mr. Ducker. The Union Volleyball coach, Mr. McKee, wants to let you know about volleyball tryouts that are coming up soon. All sophomores, juniors, and seniors that want to play next year 
There are tryouts next Tuesday and Wednesday from 4 to 5.30 at the Ninth Green Center. Athletes must present a physical dated after May 1st of 2012. If you have any questions, please see Coach McKee in room 2029. Basketball playoffs continue this weekend, and our teams have made it as convenient as possible for you to watch the boys and girls play. Both teams play Jinx Friday in Katusa. First the boys play at 6.30 and then the girls at 8 o'clock. If the boys win, they advance to the state tournament. The girls need to win two games to make it to state. Again, this is Union against Jinx. Everyone should make it to Katusa Friday night for these games. Good luck to both of our teams. That is all for this edition of the Almost Daily News. I'm Natalie Morales. And I'm Brittany Brody. Have a great day, Union High School.